Good morning, students. In continuation of our learning about our planet Earth, today we will concentrate on the topic about the uniqueness of the Earth. We will learn all those factors which make the Earth a unique place and a habitable planet. Now the Earth is at an optimum distance from the Sun. It is neither very far away from the Sun, neither very close. Had it been a little closer to the Sun, it would have been very hot like Venus or Mercury. If it would have been further away, then it would have been very cold like Jupiter or any other outer planet. The Earth is on an average 150 million kilometers from the Sun. The average temperature of the Earth on its sunlit side is 17 degrees centigrade, which is a very suitable temperature for life. Any kind of a small variation in the distance can make the Earth very hot or very cold. So, both these situations will not favor mankind to survive. Apart from this, there are several other features which will tell you how the earth is very unique. Presence of the hydrosphere. Abundance of water in all the three states, liquid, solid and gas is a unique feature of the earth and it helps to carry out all chemical reactions within the bodies of living organisms. The water also helps in transporting nutrients from the soil to the plants. Water is abundance in the oceans and seas, lakes and rivers. About 71% of the earth is watery with nearly 97.5% of its water is locked up in the oceans. The polar ice caps of Antarctica and North Polar region is in the form of solid state. Water in the form of vapor is also very very essential in order to ensure a proper supply of water and also a continuous supply. This also adds to the uniqueness of the planet. Here we can see how the sun's rays evaporates the water, forms clouds, and the clouds bring rain. And this is a continuous cycle which ensures a continuous supply of water. The envelope of air around the earth is called the atmosphere. This is also a very suitable factor which makes life possible on the earth. The perfect composition of gases available on the earth's atmosphere makes life possible on the earth. Oxygen, nitrogen and carbon dioxide have perfect proportion. Oxygen is needed by all organisms for respiration. Nitrogen helps in keeping the atmosphere cool and provides nutrients needed by plants. Had there been no nitrogen, everything around us would have been burning because of the presence of oxygen. But nitrogen 
neutralizes the combustive nature of oxygen. That is why, due to the presence of nitrogen, the earth remains cool. Carbon dioxide is essential for plant life on earth. It provides conditions which are necessary for life. The ozone layer present in the stratosphere checks the harmful UV rays. It absorbs all those harmful rays and radiations and helps life to propagate on the earth. The atmosphere absorbs all the, the terrestrial radiation emitted by the earth during the day and thus it keeps the earth warm during the night. Apart from this, the atmosphere provides a protective cover to the earth from falling meteors. And these meteors get burnt completely in the outer hot layer of the earth. Presence of lithosphere or the solid crust is also a very unique characteristic of our planet. Earth is a rocky planet which means that it is a solid and rocky covering over itself around it. Weathering of rocks make valuable layer of soil which supports plant life. The soil provides essential nutrients to the plants and help them in their growth. Plants indirectly or directly support animal life. So here we can see the plants over here are consumed by the herbivores which in turn are consumed by the carnivores. So plants directly or indirectly support the animal life. A thin layer of the outer crust, which is the storehouse for minerals, supports all industrial development. So this is the continental crust and compared to all other layers of the earth, it is very, very thin. But it is also known as the mineral skin of the earth and provides all those essential minerals which support our industries. So these were just the basic reasons which the earth proves that the earth is habitable place. Deeper studies about the earth will unfurl several other proofs as to how unique and incredible is our earth. That is what we have enough time for today. Thank you.